Home Alone is an American Christmas tradition at this point, but there are tons of dark theories around this treasured family film. From Kevin's dad being a mob boss, to Kevin growing up to being Jigsaw, to Elvis, and so on. I'm not going to cover all these theories in this video, but what I do want to talk about is a possible continuation of the story using a few of these theories. Home Alone is kind of a dark comedy if you really think about it. I'm sure you've all joked with your friends about how this is supposed to be a family film, yet it contains a shocking amount of violence. And yet everyone reveres it as a holiday classic. Maybe one you enjoy with your family every year. But for me, after watching the movie again, the dark theories are kind of hard to ignore. And now I can't help but think, what if they actually steered into that skid? In late 2015, a guy by the name of Jack DeShell started a web series called Drivers, in which a guy named Jack never seems to get a normal driver when he orders a ride. Enter Macaulay Culkin as his driver in episode 1. And also as... A grown-up Kevin McAllister. I'll leave a link to the video below if you want to go watch it, but basically he's like an Uber driver now. He shows up looking like a deranged lunatic, starts complaining about how his life turned out, mostly blaming members of his family and referencing the events that occurred in the first movie. Long story short, a man comes up and tries to carjack them, and Kevin ain't having it. He uses a very Home Alone type of way to stop the carjacker, wrap him with Christmas lights, and tie him to a chair in a nearby garage. He then threatens a guy using eerily distorted lines from his iconic film. And then it's implied that he tortures the guy. This certainly sets a different tone for the characters in the story as a whole, and I gotta say, I didn't hate it. Call me crazy, but I think it'd be kind of interesting to explore this version of the story. Like... What if because of this encounter, Kevin awakens a serial killer nature within himself and decides to seek revenge on the two home invaders that wronged him all those years ago? And maybe it doesn't even stop there. What if he realizes that he actually has his family to blame for everything? What if with Marv's last breaths, he tells him that it was actually Uncle Frank that orchestrated the whole thing in the first place? Whoa. That last part wasn't my idea, that was one of the theories, but still, that would be pretty interesting, right? As long as they don't take themselves too seriously, I think this works better as a dark comedy in my opinion. I mean, it kind of looks like they're going in a similar serial killer direction with Kevin in the Driver series, but how cool would it be if they got some more of the original cast members for this? I know Buzz is still acting because I saw him on an episode of Supernatural. Daniel Stern already made a response video, so it looks like he might be up for it. <laughs> I feel like it can only work online though. I don't think enough people would go and see something like this in the theaters, but I think it would definitely have an audience online for sure. I mean, look at Cobra Kai, right? They took a story we all knew and loved, changed the tone, made it a little funnier, changed the perspective, and it turned out pretty great. As long as you got YouTube Premium. 